A photo has appeared in the public domain that shows that the Army of the Russian Federation has at least three tanks of the T-14 Armada type, which is quite enough to form a tank platoon. And judging by the photo, the crews of these tanks are just undergoing training and mastering their machines. Against this background, it is appropriate to recall the message of Russian propagandists that the T-14 Armada was initially tested in battles against the armed forces of Ukraine since the beginning of the full-scale war against Ukraine. Then these tanks were supposedly recalled back, although there was no confirmation of such movements from open sources. And also about the plans of the Russian Army of the December 2022 model to receive at least 40 units of the T-14 Armada in the following years. In addition, the Russian armed forces have plans to increase the number of T-14 Armada in service after 2023, with the goal of obtaining at least 40 units, according to official reports from December 2022. However, it is important to consider personnel constraints, not only about how quickly the crews can learn to effectively use the T-14 Armada, but also how the resources of the Ministry of Defense of the Russian Federation will be distributed between the production of tanks for the occupying forces. In September 2023, there were also reports of Russia's intention to resume T-80 production, in particular under the T-80 Burlak project. This may indicate a desire to create a budget alternative to the T-14 Armada tank. Усім дякую за перегляд. Коментуйте новини, ставте лайки, підписуйтесь на канал. Підтримуйте канал фінансово. Деталі в описі до відео. Все буде Україна.